Well, last year, uh, Andover Town Council came and uh, saw me because what they wanted to do was a community arts project that would hopefully involve different aspects of Andover and predominantly the children in all the schools around Andover. The project um, came originally from the idea that when we talk about the huge numbers that there are in the First World War, um, you know, the, the Battle of the Somme, the first day, 20,000 people died, we don't really get our heads around that. It's, it's, as adults, it's very difficult to grasp that size of number and that sort of uh, difficult concept. Um, what I wanted to do was to make it so that uh, the children particularly, but also the adults involved, could become a little bit more personally involved. Um, there are 215 names at the moment on the Andover War Memorial. Um, and so we took this idea of taking the 215 names and we had 215 of the life-size figures cut out. Uh, not so much to directly represent individuals, but the, the concept of the 215. And these figures are now going out into schools, primary schools, secondary schools, community groups around the Andover area. Um, and they're getting to know these figures. The idea is that, um, with, with the children particularly, they'll have one of these in their classroom for the next few weeks. Um, it will be Bert or George or Fred, and they will get to know that individual. So that when, uh, come uh, the 11th of uh, November, when we have that two minute silence, there'll be this sort of, oh, I don't know anyone. Oh, actually, I do, I know, I know George, I've got to know him. And it actually means something individually to that person, the child, the, the adult who was involved in the project. Um, on the 10th of November, on Saturday the 10th of November, um, up at the Vigo Recreational Ground in Andover, the project's happening. Um, if, the, if either the people participating or the general public want to come along and view the figures during daylight so you can see what's going to happen because each one of the figures is going to be decorated by each individual group in different ways um, and then the main event the actual event is going to be in the evening between five and seven where by then it will be dark we've got a fantastic uh, backlighting atmospheric music kindly provided by andover radio um, to make it a, a, an event so that you can uh, look at these figures and uh, a moment of reflection, time to think about what's going on and time to think about the day that's coming afterwards.